collective reading for today. We have this brunette female who is tied up with some energy with the King of Swords. Some choices she has made with the intent behind the choices, it got messy. With the moon, something was hidden with the intent. Temperance is coming to clear that away. Between these two, it looks like through work, she was used or he was used as a pawn. It's like a heavy load. They played the part of a soul family trying to guide each other. And there was gifts given. It's almost like the energy is like, I'm buying you off. But she's coming up as the Nine of Pentacles. She is single now. And there's mind, body, spirit. With judgment, there's an, a spiritual awakening here. She's moving away from all the fighting and the control because there's money involved here. Justice is freeing everything up from the fighting. There, with the Three of Cups, they were putting on a show like they were celebrating, but really underneath all of that, the foundation was built on wrong intent. It was more about money and control. And it, this could be a past life connection or a past love connection. It looks like she or he wanted to be lovers and to have the, the forever love, forever after. But there was obstacles in, involved here. There was roadblocks here. The King of Swords looks like he's walking away or she left him and she walked away. But now... They're in the, it looks like either he or she is spying on someone at a distance. It could be a blonde or redhead. Because with the wallflower, she is looking, just watching what's happening. And with the two of swords, it's deciding, he or she is deciding what to do. With the long distance, they must be at a distance of this blonde or redhead who is the, coming up as the queen of cups but the lesson here is you don't go into something unless you have the right intent because it will fall apart in the end because if it's built on lies and deceit it won't last it will always crack in the end